Good. We are good to go. Go, go, Power Rangers. All right. So, uh, uh, new release from the Dark Pictures, The Devil in Me. Usually, uh, Lul, Lul E games. But we play them. We play them. They're a little bit scared. Some better than others. Some really bad. Sometimes they're they're decent. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Hopefully this one is good. It's spooky, so pregnant women and juicers. You know what to do. Be advised. Da, 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 da. Mm. What the fuck is the dark? Pictures. The devil in me. I accept your terms of privacy policy. I accept your settings. Settings. We're looking at a display. HDR. I don't even know who you are. Full screen. Depth of field, limit frame rate to 40, 30. No, I don't think so. This thing is off. Alright. Yes. Alright. Don't need no accessibility. Uh. Since when does getting scared affect pregnant women? Well, I mean, it's a roller coaster warning. I was just being silly, but okay, overanalyze. You fucking retard! Alright, new story. Oh shit, here we go. Forgiving, challenging. Do they usually have difficulty? They usually have like time. They have difficulty, but not three difficulties. Do they? They have like less time on the quick time events or decisions. I mean, I like to take my... I, I don't mind the quick time events being, but sometimes the quick time events are bugged. Like, really bad. Like, when we play the quarry. I don't think the quarry is from the same makers as this one. The quarry was really, really bad in terms of the quick time. Alright, I guess. Ah! Can they ha Do they have a quick time? Sorry, I gotta check though. Do they have a quick time warning? Like, incoming at least? Because I like to, you know, lean back a little bit in between the shit. Uh, 
Subtitles should be on, right? All right. Um. Death is inevitable. I say we go challenging, all right? I like it more about the decisions you make rather than the quick time event. Anyone can do a quick time event, but you gotta, you know, be smart about the choices. Hey, OG Krog, take it for four years. Can I get a fish for four years? Start? Boop. Yes, you may. Yes, you may. In May. Five years in woods mode. Boop. Oh, to play with a controller, press A. To play with mouse and keyboard, controls, press. Actually, I I like quick time events more on the controller than I do on keyboard. It's always scuffed on keyboard for some reason. What? Now we're committed. Every choice has a consequence. Or so they say. Some decisions save lives. Others take them. Ah, close enough. Close enough. Death. The wheel is 264 feet, Jeff. Can you imagine it? I'm attempting to. I bet you can see for a hundred miles at the top. We should make that our first priority. Whatever pleases you the most. You please me the most. You mean you are not weary of me after an entire day of marriage? I will never be weary of you. I shall hold you to that, my dear. <laughs> Snake oil ointment. I think we've arrived. Isn't this grand? As advertised. Very nice. Very nice. Let's check in. Are we the only ones here? I'm sure there was a mad dash first thing this morning to get to the fair. Try again? You teeth. Well, this does not bode well for the level of service we're in store for. Excited. Everyone else must be busy elsewhere. Let's not wait till tomorrow morning. Let's sign in and go straight there. We're not going anywhere if no one checks us in. Slow service. That means they're making sure everything is perfect. That's my Marie, sure. always finding that silver lining. My sincere apologies. Oh. For both startling you and for making you wait. My attention was needed elsewhere. I promise from here on out it will be nothing but silver linings. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. Please. That's fair. Sign in here. First time in Chicago? I'm going to hazard a guess and assume you're here to take in the exposition. The fair, yes, but that's not all. 
today is a very special day for us. Oh, a honeymoon. How very, very lovely. <laughs> what the fuck? <clears throat> Perhaps my wife, Mrs. Whitman, would like to sign. <sighs> yes, today's the beginning of our honeymoon. Congratulations. In that case, an upgrade is in order. A honeymoon suite it is. Oh, well, uh, are the rates that much higher? <laughs> I think nothing of it. The same rates as your regular room. The upgrade is on us. You're our first honeymooners. How kind. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. Henry Howard Holmes. Not even Charlotte. You have a lovely hotel, Mr. Holmes. Well, thank you very much. I designed and built most of it myself. You're an architect, then? Architect, designer, builder, doctor. Unlucky. Artist. I'm a man of many interests. Impressive. Please have a look around. Unlucky. We have sundries and Hello, Force. I just wanted to remind you that I will become president of the United States before you beat a single mechanical boss. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. We appreciate it. The pleasure is all mine. Always trust a man with a mustache. Don't smash it, okay? Don't smash it! Now, what did I forget to bring? You forgot to bring... Bath milk. Pardon me, miss. Careful, you. My husband gets awfully cross with men who act fresh. Hmm. <laughs> he sounds like a ripe fellow. Act fresh? How's the marriage going? Lovely. Thanks for asking. Well, let's just head up. I'm sure the room is ready. See anything good over there at the jewelry counter? Anything fancy? Wouldn't you like to know? I wonder what's in here. I'm starting to think I've gone and married a thrill seeker. Ferris wheels, forbidden rooms. Are we looking for excitement? Perhaps. <sighs> Nothing but an unfinished room. See what happens when you chase a thrill? If this is you trying to get out of the Ferris wheel. I know you won't be denied. Wait, what's that? <gasps> Don't move.
That was a thrill. You won't think it's what thrilling. What a thrill! On the street after getting kicked out of here. It's the tutorial. Uh, relax. What the fuck? <laughs> Welcome, newlyweds, to the honeymoon suite. Sweet. Thank you kindly, Mr. Holmes. Do enjoy your stay. If you'll excuse me, I have work to return to. I'm sure we'll see each other again soon. <laughs> Goodness, this place is fit for a king. Or my queen. Oh, you. Kiss this. That is not very wifely of you. Hey! Ah, bullseye! You asked for it. What? <laughs> Should I be frightened? If you're smart. <laughs> Parry. Motherfucker. Mercy, mercy. Okay, you win. Anything broken? Only my pride. How about a peace offering? Hmm. This feels like some sort of treacherous plot. Not at all. I have a gift for you. Close your eyes and face the mirror. Aren't you clever and romantic? <coughs> if I get a pillow to the face, I will sock you right in the kisser. Is there a problem? No. Open your eyes. Oh, Jeff, it's lovely. I love it. Good. <laughs> Victory is mine. I'll let you have that bath now. The fucking video camera and What year is this again? Nineteen twenty. Oh, it's just a peephole, like a lens. It's jammed shut. Maybe if we put a little weight into it. <laughs> Open sesame. <laughs> Thank you. Why don't you have a shave while I take a quick bath? Then we can reconvene. I know that word. It's French for something illicit. <laughs> Shush. Shave. I think I forgot to pack my razor and kit. I'm sure the pharmacy downstairs has them. Don't be too long in that bath. <laughs> don't you worry. Eighteen ninety-three. Settle in the hotel. Find a shaving kit. Better not. Better not. Run. No running in the corridors. Hmm. I could have sworn this was the way we I'm came. I'm like expecting to see fucking twins on tricycles. What? Ah, oh, shit. 
Can they just fuck off with that UI? I'm not even memeing. Good God. I, one black and one white. Please. Fuck. If I was on screen carrying equipment, I had to have the roof. Bro, who plays with the arrow keys? Huh? W A S D, motherfucker. W A S D. Sorry, I gotta do this right away. Otherwise, I'm gonna mold Silla this shit. Controls. Mouse and keyboard. Key bindings. Oh. Alright, I guess that's fair. Uh, it's only for like. Low key chill situations. That's fine. She feels very um teleporty. <laughs> Her animations more than any any other character. Is that you, darling? Jeff? Oh, are we playing another game? Relax, investigate. I think I will relax. Back already? You know, this tub is awfully big. I think there might be room for another body. Oh. Hmm, that's nice. You don't know your own strength. Easy, dear. Jeff, that hurts. Hello, my dear. Ah! Oh, I know. We don't want to disturb the other guests. Let go of me! Let go of me! I really thought we'd have a little more fighting in. Chat, relax, all right? This is just the intro. What are you doing? They are You've supposed to. You've touched Maria. a bit late with that sentiment, good sir. Is there a problem, sir? Big problem. <coughs> awesome, you are playing a poor excuse for a video game. You are literally watching a movie on stream right now. And somehow you still find a way to blame the UI and the controls. Please clarify. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
So that's where he gets the jewelry from. A place for everything. Everything in its place. Well, look at this. Oh, it's wonderful. Only the best for you, my dear. Mother would simply die. It's so I say, opulent. good man, do you work here? Hello. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. I insist that animal fever one year, dude. Philips XMG Rigord a GMG 2012 Drone Nachtan RJ and Mr. Maniki. RJ one to three with five years. Sugar badge. Told you it was scripted. You cannot save those two. Little Tom Hanks. Well, what is this that I can't see without the hands getting all of me? Well, I am dead. None can. Have you been waiting long? No. It's always good when a familiar face returns. Obviously, you're in the mood he knows me. for a new tale. I'm a VIP around these parts. It's so good to have company. For a long time, I was on my own. I can barely recall a time when I wasn't here, watching over these tales. And what good are stories? without somebody to experience them. This is a story about those who create and the lengths they might go to for their art to be made pure. Art can elicit all sorts of reactions, delight, inspiration, desire, yes, but also doubt, fear, dread. Doubters. The way you react, the decisions you make, will affect this story. Hidden in the world, you'll find dark pictures. They give glimpses of the possible consequences of your choices. And sometimes it's the smallest choices that can have the biggest repercussions. You're responsible for what happens. You're culpable. I can't interfere. That's very much against the rules. I can only observe what happens and record any significant events. Oh. Ever seen one of these? They're very old. People used to call them obols. They'd put them in the mouth of the recently deceased to pay the ferryman. Look out for them. You'll find them in the strangest places. I'll be happy to exchange any that you find, and I'll certainly make it worth your while. 
Okay. Well, shall we start? Game is afoot. I will be watching. My name is Kate Wilder. I've got a master's in criminal psychology. I'm an investigative journalist and hope to make a difference. You may have recently seen my interview on Chicago AM on... Uh, 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 and, uh, and yeah, it's really tough when just being honest means everyone thinks you're a bitch. I'm not sure I've got issues to deal with, same as everyone. I I'm working on it. I... I'm Mark, I study photography at UCLA. Um, had a great time. Really want to get back into some serious photography. Uh, but yeah, it's a, it's a job. I've done a key grip and lighting test for years. See a problem, light it. Lighting technician. You don't often meet someone like that. Man, how do you even start? I'm sick of being on my own. Sorry, do you start with qualifications or, um, like, personal info? Because I don't, I mean, will anyone access this? I'm kind of private, actually. Uh, yeah, Charlie Lonitz, UK originally. I've uh, been here for 20 years. The last series was so on track. It was, uh, it was a very beautifully conceived and, um, didn't quite, uh, uh hit the mark as I was. It's a fucking mess, to be honest with you. I think we've heard quite enough. Enough? <laughs> oh, I've barely begun, Your Honor. You don't seem to understand. I was born with the devil in me. I could not help the fact that I was a murderer any more than a poet can help the inspiration to sing. Bury me deep, your honor. Make sure they fill my pine box with cement. Put me deeper than anyone else and cover the ground with more cement cause trust me. Just being dead ain't enough to stop me from killing again. On May 7th, 1896, Herman Mudgett, a.k.a. Henry H. Holmes, was sent to the gallows. His neck did not snap from the force of hanging. Records indicate he hung, slowly suffocating for over 15 minutes, until finally the monster was dead. America's first serial killer confessed to 27 murders, but his investigators sifted through the traces he left behind, following his path from city to city, the number grew significantly. Nearly 200 lives. America's first serial killer, and possibly the worst. He was buried as requested, under concrete. Was he hoping to hide from God's judgment? Or did he truly want to keep the devil from climbing out and killing again? So, what do you think? Very good. To be honest, Charlie, this is a pilot. Hold that thought. Lonnet Entertainment. Charles Lonnet, please. Speaking. Charlie is fine. My name is Grantham Dumet. What can I do for you, Mr. Dumet? Actually, it's what I can do for you. Hear me out. I'm certainly grateful to you, Mr. <clears throat> Dumet. This all sounds amazing, but I, uh, I just, I'm waiting to hear what the catch is. No offense. None taken. I'm in a privileged position. I don't need for much, but my time is at a premium. We need to do this today. I'll send a car for you this afternoon, 4 p.m. Be ready. This afternoon? We're talking a couple of days shoot. I've told my team they're free this weekend, and frankly, they're a temperamental bunch. Without them, this conversation <laughs> is dead in the water. We, uh... I've told you what I have. Please don't waste my time. Am I sending the car or not? 
Yes, of course. We're in. I'll get them there. I promise. Let's do it. Fancy. Mr. Dumet send you. We. A lime scene. Right. Let's load up, guys. I right, got it. I'm good. He's independent, man. Sorry. Get with the times. Are you? I mean, this is that ring light that makes it all glowy. We leave him behind it. Right. You're right. This is going to be grand, people. Adventure. <laughs> Excitement. Anyone? Road trip. Huzzah. Woohoo. Hooray. Huzzah. It's going to be great, guys. <laughs> Hey, the album even three years. Plat acquired for an EMC. Plat? Plat in what? So do we know where we're going exactly? Oh, Diamond no, Batch. You know what this just reminds me of? That's right. Topeka. Exactly. Me, no money in my pocket, a dead phone, and lost in the middle of goddamn Topeka. That wasn't my fault. It was 100% your fault. Because you fly by the seat of your ass. So, come on, Charlie. What do we know about this guy? He's rich, he's a recluse, he's obsessed with H.H. Holmes. Totally sane, I'm sure. We're going to a property he inherited from a relative. That's who had the obsession with Holmes. Some of the rooms are full recreations from the murder castle. Dumet has blueprints, documents, artifacts. When I said this would save the show, I was not exaggerating. And you substantiated all of this? Just trust me. Sorry for all the mystery. Before we go any further, I have to ask that we lock up your phones for safekeeping. While this may sound strange that I invite you to film the collection inside my home, I cannot allow any personal devices that Was may share information that can affect you know my this? business or lifestyle. There are rules. All footage you wish to use must be authorized by me first. I require privacy and discretion. I must insist. His place, his rules. <laughs> Look, what he's offering us is worth it. You see the fucking exorcist Could be move there? His pay, but he isn't. The oh, fuck? If this is all he asks, then we do. Fine. For the show. Show must go. I'm telling you, this is gonna be great. You said that in Topeka. Top Kika. Hey, Mr. Pink. Think for five years. Love you, BB. And a heart emoji. Very nice. Thank you. Enjoy your whole batch, man. Prudenshi and Killan BSO. Welcome back. Welcome. Not Milk Sadie. Of course. 16 months. If this dude is so rich, shouldn't he have service or something? This guy gonna help? <clears throat> Thanks, bro. Oh, I thought it was Daredevil it. for a second. Jackass. Okay. So now what? I'd love to get some footage of the lake and the scope of this. Not with all the mist and fog. There. From on high, we'll get a better look. That's certainly... Um up there the, the visuals will be great and we can frame up over the mist charlie you'll hack up a lung before you're halfway up there i'm fit as a butcher's dog Ooh. mark Ooh. this is crazy Ooh. we'll be fine Ooh. let's go charlie Ooh. be careful guys nice knowing you nice filter bro shoot some footage from the top of the lighthouse Boost me here. Always me carrying, huh? Hey, guys, hurry up! We're on it! Last one, there's a cocksucker! <laughs> It's loud. It's meant to be heard from miles away. Well, yeah, I know that in theory, but... Warning, so cliff erosion. We must be able to work our way around. Come on. 
These cliffs Anything are subject to erosion shot, and right? may collapse into deep water without warning. It doesn't look too serious. The warning about everything falling into the ocean. I'm gonna say we trusted and not die. Nah, this sign is something the lawyers made them put up. I'm sure it's fine. Hard disagree. Listen, Mark, I just wanted to say um, thanks for backing me up, man. What? About getting this footage? No, for the whole trip. You know some of the crew can be challenging. To work with. Jamie and Kate would never have agreed to come if you hadn't been on board. I figured that the episode was such a mess, we needed all the help we could get. Right. Yeah. I guess we do. Okay, I won't lie. I was hoping being here all remote and away from the world that maybe I'd have some downtime, some space to decompress. Downtime? Why would you want to do that? You know, relax a bit. I've never seen the attraction. Relax. Must have been quite a storm. Yeah! Super jumper. This guy really wants the fucking footage, huh? Let's fucking die here. Force it. Be all quick. Force it. Force him quick. Where's the bucket of water? El Clásico! <laughs> Press the toggle light source. Hey, right. when we wrap, I'd like to take a couple weeks off. Go see my family. I need you in post. I really appreciate that discerning eye of yours, you know. I got a lot going on at the moment, Charlie. I feel oh, like they don't even have right, equipment yeah, with them. Sure. Take a couple of weeks. Get your head together. There I he does. It. I'll be fine in post on my own. You should do the same. Take some time out. You got any family you can go and bother? Oh, well. No, Mrs. Lonnet, you got hiding in some closet somewhere? Married to the job. Married to the job. <laughs> it wasn't that How's funny. That marriage working out. Well, from what I hear about real marriages, pretty damn good. <laughs> Married to the job. He's never heard that before. <laughs> Christ, what the hell is that? A mannequin. You know, <laughs> just hanging out. Maybe it's part of some old museum display or something. Right. That's probably it. Well played. Well played. <laughs> hey. I was the only jumper in chat. <sighs> I dry sold with the one year dude. My one year minus sixty little W. Teal is an L man horse to welcome back. Yeah, just 
keeps looking at the line on the mess. How is that going to fit into the show? It just caught my eye. Come in. It's not called games and shit. Always for that the reason. I can't exactly turn it off. There's a lot of crossover between the creative stuff and the commercial stuff. Hmm. You sure about that? Because crossover with Kate hasn't exactly. We agreed been. to let that drop for the weekend. Just making sure your head's in the game. Oh, we gotta find a um, bolt cutter. Let's see. Anything in here? Nope. That works. <coughs> May there be light. This thing hasn't been manned in ages. Why is the horn still going? Because they didn't decommission the fog. It's all automatic now. Vacation time. What are we looking at here? Zombie state. Read, please. I think I will read this. Keep it up, team. Uh, this sh should be the final week. Last night's foghorn test was successful. Look like the automation is all up and running. We'll do one final trial today and we can pack away the kit. A couple of you have reported that homeless guy hanging around again. We're going to be jump bumping up, securing the compound and conducting final checks today and tomorrow just to be on the safe side. Don't want anyone getting injured. Other than that, the work's been great, all project, so let's keep up the peace, pace and we'll be out of here by the end of the week. T.S. Okay. It's a hobo. Uh, well, there's no fucking uh, bolt cutter or anything here, so I'm not sure what I'm doing in here. To be quite honest, I guess we're getting out of here. Uh, I got nothing. Get squeezed through here, facing. Miss Legendary Shotgun. Surely. Fuck, I hate this mashing left mouse button. Don't get scared, Forsen. It was just me. <laughs> so a clone feels okay, man. Not a sucker screaming like. Ah! This looks pretty old. <laughs> Alright, Charlie can use this tie clip to open lock boxes. Alright. Aha! Legendary! Just some old coin. Find the penny, pick it up. One. Look, sorry I give you a hard time now and again, but I really couldn't make these shows without you. That's not true. I may be driving this car. What car? The Lonnet Entertainment car. But you're the one who keeps the engine going. It's not how cars work. Jesus, you try and give someone a compliment. Thanks, Charlie. Should have saved that fucking uh, lockpick for the actual non-cosmetic stuff. 
some objects can be pushed and pulled around. Alright. Let's see here. Breaking and entering? How are you not in jail? <laughs> Christ, what the hell is that? Some new mechanics, huh? What? Nice to meet you too. What? Am I supposed to see what that was? Was that like a, a fucking rat or something? What the fuck was that? Yeah, but they told me to hide. I cannot see if I'm holding Q. Wait, what the fuck? May there be light. Alright, let's see. What's cooking? Alright, I'm gonna go through this sus crack in the wall. Just need some fresh sheets, some nice drapes, and six gallons of sanitizer. Uh, are you coming, man? I'm not going up here alone. Hey, Rice in with the fucking 10 gifts. Oh, thank you very much, man. Congratulations to the lucky winners, of course. Much appreciado, as we say in this video. I'm getting an uneasy feeling about this. Somebody has a taxidermy hobby. Relax. <laughs> Some hobby. The greater streamer watching movie instead of play game for more than 26 minutes. Impossible to play. What in God's name is this? A game. To you. Limbs and shit. Signal somewhere in the world. It's a robot crow. Well, there's nothing here. Oh, I guess we're going up. It's gonna be okay. It's all gonna be okay. Wow, what a view. Look at this. It's perfect. Come on, get shooting. I want you to pan across the lake until the island comes into shot. Then zoom into that lighthouse. Nice professional fucking Look, Michael J. Right. Fox photographer. Come on. We better get back. One shot. One opportunity. That him? I don't know. We just had the one call. Uh, how did he know what our show was about in the first place? Uh, actually, I didn't ask. That's weird. Let's just play nice, okay? Hello, Mr. Lonnet. That's me. I'm Grantham Demet. Everyone climb aboard and we'll head out. This is Mark. Mark. Erin. Jamie. Ladies. And this is Kate. That's definitely you, not Mr. Dumet. Dumet. I'm looking forward to seeing all it is you have to offer. We truly appreciate this. Lovely to meet you all. 
What say we get underway? Again, I really can't thank you enough for this opportunity. Of course. Was it your great uncle you said that... Um... Let's get to where we're going. I'll explain everything later. Sure. Of course. Mm -hmm. Sure. I don't trust this guy for a second. Also, if he lives in that island and he's super rich, shouldn't they have a nicer boat to pick them up in than this fucking ferry? Let's get up to the hotel. Please, let's stay close. Stick together. Is it dangerous here? No, of course not. You sure? Because you don't seem sure. It's perfectly safe. But we are a long ways from help if somebody gets hurt, so please, take care. Looks like things are buttoned up tight around here, God. This way. Don't worry about your bags. I'll make sure they're brought. Slow, deep breaths, Charles. Try Don't not to cough up a diseased us. lung. I'll be fine. Just pretend there's a carton of smokes at the top of the hill. You're right. He takes his security very seriously. Just pretend that there's a soy latte. I wonder what he's afraid will get in. Maybe you should be asking what he's trying not to let out. Jamie. Just saying. You watch too many horror movies. He values his privacy. We've known that right from the start. We've known that for about two hours. Just go. Mark, get your camera. I want to grab a quick intro from here. I need some shots leading up to the house. Don't need the whole journey. Kate, talking to camera, then I'll direct you from there, okay? No photos. No recording of me at all. Is that clear? I'm a very private person. Don't worry, Mr. Dumet. Discretion is Lona Entertainment's motto. You want the usual intro stuff, Charlie? Please. The light is good. I'm ready to go, Aaron. It sounds clear. Okay, let's go for a take then. Is Kate's face ready? Bitch, I'm always camera ready. Stop trying to make me like you. Rolling. Speed. And action. I've just arrived on the private island which claims to have genuine artifacts from H.H. H. Holmes' reign of terror. I'm heading to the house right now. Perfect, Kate. Now turn to face the house and start to walk. Okay, that's enough. And cut. We really do need to get going. Anything you say, Mr. Dumas? This way. You'll steal some more shots, right? Obviously. Mr. Dumet is being really restrictive. I noticed. I want you to go look around without him knowing. The man is entitled to his privacy. He's cagey. I want to know what he's trying to hide. What do you want to do? What you did that time with those cops in Glendale. Seriously? Ah! Ow! Oh my! Damn it! What happened? You okay? Did you get your baby ego again? We should get her up to the hotel. Oh my god, I can barely move it. Jamie, stay with her. Why me? Because you know first aid. Remember how you patched her up? In Glendale? Oh, right. Okay. We'll find some ice and a bandage and come back. You have that at the hotel? Yes, sure. Then let's go. What is going on? Come on. I'll clue you in later. Been taking acting classes again? Yeah, yeah. 
What's Charlie want? A better lay of the land. And we're the scouts because? I'm charming, and you can hotwire your way past security. Come on. Check it out. Hey, can I ask you something and get a straight answer? You know, without you making a smart ass reply or taking a shot at me. That works both ways. Fine. Oh, tell me the truth. Is there any saving oh. this show? Maybe. If there's some sort of magical holy grail of footage or information to be had here. Secret phone. You think that's likely? No. At best, we'll get some nice. What the fuck? The little shoe missing a heel. All you right. know, that's not gonna save our asses. Private property, keep out. Well, if they're already on the island, then <laughs> it's a bit of a scramble. in here nothing here we are blocking uh, he could have told us uh, to uh, try not to fall and die I don't want to see Mark cry. Thanks for the concern. Really. Uh-oh. Oh. 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 Alright. We're fine. Any more of those coins anywhere? Hello? No? Wonder where this goes. Straight up and down the hill. Yeah. But what's on the other end? Boost me. Yeah. With your family? My wife is. She died. Oh shit. Oh shit. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to be rude. Come on. We're about there. They didn't see us. Let's go. This is ridiculous. There's nothing out here. I gotta be faster with those hiding thingies. Literally force him. All right. Any coins? Hmm. Something in there. But well, we're not getting in there without the key. Somebody's watching me. If I wanted to go on nature hikes, I wouldn't have moved to the city. This shit is not in my job description. Holding a mirror. 
calling it a job. This reminds me of shit summer camps. Bama no. Missed box. Well, such is the way of uh, life. Okay. If I can get the car moving and stop it here, we'll be able to get across. Are you really? You see the control panel? It's trashed. I don't even think there's power. The dark pictures anthology. The Devil in Me, released on 18th November 2022, received critical acclaim from reviewers for being the first high-generated video game script. Mikasa kills Eren. Massima kills Power and Oki. 137 cow, 137 cow, 137 cow. Phil. Ah, may they be light. Maybe we can get this thing working. Ah, here we go. Legendary toolbox, unlootable. Hang on. My guess is that I missed. A legendary coin here, hundred percent. I know it. By the old gods and the new. Otherwise, why would you be able to climb up here? That's right, God Gamer instincts strikes again. Toss a coin to your Twitcher. Wait, I got five coins from that? Ooh. Nice. Valley of Plenty. Jamie, can you fix this? What? Oh, it was like a GTA switcher only? Okay. Uh, equip the multimeter. Fix the fuse! Uh, I don't know what you want from me. Uh, what the fuck do you want? Uh, hello? What the fuck is this? It's like hand simulator. It don't work. Read. The wiring here is ancient. Follow the arrows and don't go out of sequence unless you want to trip the whole system. Yeah, I can't do it. I cannot press. Oh, spacebar. But they say it's fucking mouse one. Retards! Hey, devs. Retards! I can't even go down! What the fuck? I told you! Least retarded game devs in the current year. I'm fucking kidding me, dude. This is so scuffed. 
Uh, wait, what? Left or right? What the fuck? What the fuck? You stupid! You're so fucking dumb! What is this? Hand simulator is actually easier. I cannot. Oh yeah, it, I'll use the arrow keys, I guess. Because you can't use the mouse. And you can't press mouse one. That's a lie. Alright, back to hipster. Take it to the hip. Hop. The hipster. Your time. I'm pressing Q. Jesus fucking Christ, this is so scuffed. Holy shit. If I die, it's 100% the game. If I lose a single character, it's 100% the game. Wonder what these are. Hazardous substance. Might be bitcoins. I guess I just needed to rest it for a minute. I think I'm okay. I found a shortcut up the hill. I really need you to stay where I say. You got it, Mr. Dumet. We're all here now. Let's head on. Everyone stay under the watchful eye of Mr. Dumet, please. Kate. What do you think? A summer camp from hell. Whatever. We're gonna find out what's up his sleeve before too long. Don't worry about that. Coming or what? Uh-huh. You afraid of heights? Maybe. Yes. Oh, shit! We're all gonna die! Just go. <laughs> oh my god, relax, Mark. Ooh, that's serious drop. You good? Oh man. Want a piggyback ride? Don't be an asshole. Okay, sorry. Remember what your therapist friend said? 
that belittling your neuroses is not an effective strategy to help you overcome them. I know. I'm saying I'm sorry. Thank you. Forsen, I hand. have to know, once and for all, are you a bitch boy? If not, how do you That's know it. that you aren't a bitch boy? Look, Has someone right. told you, or are you just assuming that down. you aren't a bitch boy? Yeah. <laughs> Your mother told me. See? Not so bad. <sighs> bitch. Thank you. You always knew how to get me through the shit, didn't you? We should catch up to Mr. Dumet. Where is everyone? Apologies, uh, they're all city folk. Come on, let's go. We're losing the day, people. Did you see I built a replica of the house? The Holmes house? This, wow! Mr. Dumet, this place is magnificent. Yeah. Maybe this won't be a waste of a weekend. Private property. Keep out. I wonder who you are. What are you doing? I... I saw a little girl. Up there. Maybe it's your one fan. And now she's lost forever. You are such a dick. Everything in here is fragile. Please be careful. Fragile, but not that fragile. Look at this. It's amazing. This is intense. Would you all mind signing in at the desk, please? Uh, this isn't everything. I'm sure the rest is almost here. I I'll make sure it gets to your rooms. Kate's makeup case is slowing it down. Erin, cigarettes. Blue backpack. Settle in, and I'll meet you all at dinner. Eddie. Mr. Dumet, I cannot say thank you enough times. This is truly fantastic. I told you all this was a good plan, didn't I? <laughs> I told you. One seven eight. What is that? Is that the amount of people that he killed? The Holmes guy. Oh, there you are. Busy, busy, busy. You've been out in a battle day, and I have to sit here worrying. Gone all day and not a word from you. You're jumpy. Oh my god. I think I peed a little. How did you not hear me coming? I was... I don't think we're the only ones here. Kate saw a little girl looking out a window at us when we were outside. That's who I saw. A little girl. 
Mr. Demet probably has family, his staff, maybe friends. Who knows? That said, this place does give me the willies. It's, um, it's unique. Are you singing? Oh, yeah, that's my being scared song. This is my don't be scared song. Sing it and I won't be scared long. <laughs> Doesn't really work. I bet. Random 181. Singing. Uh, I think I'm around the corner. 183? This is me. Okay. Okay. Good luck out there. Don't get lost. Scream if you need me for anything. Thanks. I got you. Nothing to be scared of. Actually, hey. Yeah? Why don't you hang a second while I unpack, then I can help you find your room? Something about this place makes me want to use the buddy system. Yes, thanks. I'd end up lost, probably. It's, it's just a haul, dude. Then why are you proposing helping her finding her room? And oh. here we are. Well, it's, um, cozy? Hmm. It's one step above one of those Japanese capsule hotels. Oh, come on. Could be way worse. Like our room in Topeka. No, nope, do not. I've blocked that from memory and don't want it coming back. Because of the roaches? Because of you snore. Uh, where's the bathroom? Wait, what? Old school. Uh, gross school? What do I have to pee in the middle of the night? Am I gonna walk in on Charlie sitting on the pot? Guess that means there's no mini bar either. Oh. Shows what you know. What is that? Wine, genius. Oh, I feel like if we start drinking, Charlie will find out and lecture me and make me feel like an asshole again. Yeah, he does that. But we're not on the clock. Not until we're rigging to shoot. Which is hard to do drunk. <laughs> I'm not suggesting we get full on hammered before we work. Why are you doing that? I'm thirsty. Also, you're cute when you're worked up. I don't... cute? You think I'm cute? Hmm? Oh. Gotta stick on my own if you want to share lip cooties. Thanks, but I can find mine. Where'd it go? Uh, it's uh, all the way against the wall. See it? <coughs> you okay? <coughs> Shit. You trying to scare me now? <coughs> no. Revenge? Because good job. What the fuck is happening? It's all the way against the wall. It's barely under the bed. I fucking saw it. Fucking asthma. Since when did you have asthma? Since I was born. My meds are good. It's normally not a thing. I just need to be more careful of things like dust and pollen and getting the shit scared out of me. I'm an asshole. You didn't know. It's fine. Promise. You sure? Sure, I'm sure. So, uh, yeah. Cozy. <laughs> you gonna try that? And now you're poisoned. It's not that bad. You're not lying? It's piquant. Decent vintage. Sure. I'm getting... Oaky undertones, a hint of citrus. Oh. And I want to say a strong, healthy amount of moldy sweat dots. <laughs> oh my God, <laughs> I hate you. You are such a liar. Oh, sorry. I thought you meant the thinking you were a cute thing. Really? 
Um, if my cheeks are red, it's from this wine. Not because I am bashful. I swear. Really. Sorry. Didn't mean to make you feel weird. I... Uh, yeah, it's just... We hey. work together, and when in Rome. Charlie is always on me about being more professional, and... I get it. No, I mean, I, I'm not saying I don't appreciate it. Er, er. Or that I don't think you're cute, too. It's just, um... What are you doing? Uh, oh my god, I, uh, I... <laughs> oh, you bitch! I'm just fucking with you. I wanted to kiss you for months. I just was scared to make a real move. Oh! oh! Sorry, sorry. What the fuck is going on in this game? Huh? Who is that? <sighs> Enjoying yourself out here like some sort of pervert? Sorry, did I uh, interrupt something here? No, we're just talking shop. We're worried about the power grid handling all of our gear. Yeah, yes. If this place is running on a generator, we need to know what it's putting out. I don't care what you guys are doing. Then why are you lurking? I can't find my room, and I need a fucking cigarette. <laughs> These funny shapes are numbers. They go up and down in order. Thank you. I've just been down there. Look, give me ten, then we should get a rough plan for getting our first shot. We have all evening. Can we plan after dinner? I'd like to chill for a minute after the trek getting here. I want to be shooting after dinner. You've got ten minutes. Okay. We'll be down in a few then. Oh, Erin, I checked my blue bag. No cigarettes. That's where I put them. Come and show me. Maybe one of us is colorblind and doesn't know what a blue bag is. <sighs> To be continued, then? Yes, definitely. <laughs> Good luck finding your rooms. Hey, Rain Chaos, even four years, man. It's been four years, Mr. What Force. the fuck is this Let's dame? What the fuck is Friday. this dame? About what the fuck is this dame? What is it about? About what the fuck is huh? this dame? About what the fuck is this dame? About what the. Fuck is this dame? About what the fuck is this dame? About what the fuck is this guy? What the fuck is this game about? Where the hell are they going? Well, they're out of here. I'm guessing that wasn't Mr. Dumont, the met. God, it was a one-way mirror. What's happening? Charlie's well, bedroom. I'm looking. Oh, Kate wanted you to have this. Breaking down walls, navigating the maze of anxiety. Are you fucking kidding me? I think she thought it might help with your stress. Or... Absolutely not. I'm not stressed. Okay. Do yeah, I look fucking stressed? That's typically normal uh... behavior. That was rhetorical. Well, your cards came out nice enough. Oh, yeah. Embossing. Makes a huge difference. 
You old guys love business cards. <laughs> old school. You old school guys. Let's have a look at your card. I also put it on heavy stock and did the logo in foil. Damn. I should have had one ready for Mr. Dumet. Did you find them? I... no. I swear I put them in here. I don't understand. <sighs> Look, stop tearing around in there like a maniac. Be organized about it. Methodical. How about you keep track of your Blue own bag, cigarettes? Front pocket. I made a specific what mental the note fuck? of it. They're gone, Charlie. Gone? Just like that? Are you saying somebody took them? I I don't. Actually, I can see Kate doing that. Or Jamie. I'm sorry. It's fine. Let's just get on with things. Yeah, you seem this fine. This place is massive. Surely there is a pack of cigarettes in here somewhere. Even if they're ancient. You need them that bad? There was a bar off the lobby. There must be cigarettes in the bar, right? I mean, technically, it's not legal to smoke in bars, so... Come on, we're checking. If you find them first, all will be forgiven. Um, he really wants his fucking cigarettes. Just checking. The scope of this place is... I can't believe we've looked into this. Are you worried it will make our other episodes look cheap? They are cheap. Can't be helped. This will be the one that people remember. The one that wins an Emmy. Oh shit. Exactly. Grand the theme du mid. Architect. Me, I'm going places. You think we'll get another season? Let me worry about that. You stick to making sure that my life runs smoothly and I'll make sure you keep working. Ivory balls. Sound good? Uh, sure. Look at that. Damn, this is like a fucking maze. Aha, I thought you could get away. Another coin for your Twitcher. It's got to be worth something. Pack of cigarettes, maybe. Wait, what the fuck? How sometimes the coin is worth one, and then the second coin I find is worth five, and now this one is worth one again? Random. It's a fucking slot machine, dude. Oh, the harder they are to find. Oi! Oi! I see you, motherfucker. <coughs> Send from Grantham Dumit to Joseph Morello. Good evening. Thank you for allowing me to contact you directly. Your publisher said that you were very keen to hear from me. It seems we have a mutual interest. I have spent several years constructing the ultimate Holmes tourist experience by faithfully recreating the World's Fair Hotel. We have not yet considered a man of your knowledge could provide insight that is invaluable before our official opening. Therefore, I invite you to visit the hotel for the weekend. The experience is designed to accommodate groups of five guests, so I extend the invitation to four friends or family of your choosing. I must insist that this invitation be kept confidential until the hotel is publicly announced. So please only invite guests you can trust to do so. I hope you can accept my invitation. Please reply to confirm your attendance and the four additional guests that you would like to bring. Should you accept, a limousine will pick you yourself and your guests up at 7 p.m. this Friday underneath the railway. Hello, Fawson. Your title says games and shit. I can see the shit and I assume the games will come afterwards. Yes. But where is the end? <laughs> Thank you, Chad. I'm here all evening. Bye-bye. 
Bye bye. Hi Grantham, uh, thanks. I bid Liza to come along. I'm sure I can get my wife and two girls to join me. My brother Francis is in town at the minute, so that will make up the five. I trust them all with my life, so no sweat over confidentiality. See you Friday. Joe. Joe Mama. Alright, let's go. Hey Charlie, <laughs> I was hoping next season maybe I could do more with the sound design, more creative stuff. Erin, what you already do for this company is very valuable to us. Carrying your bags and picking up your laundry? Absolutely. To get ahead in this industry, you have to pay your dues. Show you're ready to muck in. Yeah, you seem so ahead in this fucking I... industry. <laughs> I think you should get an assistant. An assistant? Oh, it was just a stupid idea, Charlie. I'm an just... An assistant? A personal assistant? Sort of. And then I could help out with the editing. Pardon me? The editing? The audio mix. Look, I just think you've got so much to give, so much experience. And it's an opportunity to pass that knowledge on. Right. Yes, I suppose it is. And an assistant wouldn't lose my cigarettes, would they? Exactly. So, do you still want to direct movies, Charlie? I am directing. Hey, maybe Mr. Dumet is in the back office. You could just ask him about cigarettes. No, but I mean real movies. With a big budget and big stars. Erin, there's something important you have to understand. In the work that we do, the very important work, the truth is the star. Oh, right. Yeah, sorry, Charlie. So you don't want to direct movies. Can we move on from this? Who the fuck was ringing the bell? This tells me nothing. I suppose I should be thankful, it's just my cigarettes that I'm missing and not our gear. Where the fuck is the bar? Oh! Hello. This wasn't here before. Jackpot. Erin! I found the key! Ugandan key. Uh, well, it can't be the private place. It's probably the one in the hall, then, yeah? You were just standing here all along? Go check for a gift shop or Good something. One, shot. I've already had one asthma attack today, and this dust farm is exactly what I don't need. A gift shop might have cigarettes. Exactly. Had a girl. Hello? Oh, I know this scene. Mr. Dumet? Wow! An animatronic. That's what amazing. will it be, Mr. Dumet, sir? <laughs> I'll have a packet of cigarettes, please. A packet of cigarettes, please. Hello? Hello? A packet of smokes. Figured it was too good to be true. Never mind. Thank you, Robo Bowman. Certainly, sir. Whatever you wish. <laughs> no fucking way. Thank you very much, my mechanical friend. Much appreciated. Science, bitch. Miss Kelly Schroeder. 
Once again, I would like to thank you for the incredible work you and your team achieved at the hotel. I'd like to extend my heartfelt condolences. The accident that befell the skeleton crew on the lake is nothing short of a tragedy, and I, in part, feel responsible. In honor of them, I have spent the last several months applying the finishing touches to the hotel, and I'm proud to say that we are almost ready to open to the public. Please allow me to extend my sincere gratitude. I invite yourself and the rest of your team to join me in another little bait, huh? Alright. Let's fucking have a smoke. It's better not be camel. Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh. Of course it was exact change. Damn it! Well, I have those fairy coins. Search the bar for money. I mean, stealing. Do you have any change? This is a big problem. I don't suppose you've got any spare change back there, have you? Thought not. Good morning to you all. I'm Chester Bell. Assistant Director at the Federal Bureau of Investigation. At approximately 0530 local time, a team led by Special Agent Hector Monday and supported by law enforcement officers conducted a raid of a motel room just outside Birmingham, Alabama to apprehend Manny Sherman, the man known as the Beast of Arkansas. Using state-of-the-art psychological profiling techniques, Special Agent Monday and members of his task force not only identified their suspect, but predicted his movement with unerring accuracy. I'm delighted to say, we have our man. Who was it? <clears throat> Is it a famous serial killer? Chest set. I need some fucking change, man. Fucking cigarettes. <sighs> I haven't had smoke all day. The final cigarette. All right. Uh. That doesn't seem like a good flash forward. But now that we've seen it, surely we can prevent fate. Right? I'm not getting through there. I don't know I'm, what I'm trying to achieve here, but... Oh, look at this. Here we go. Swipe it. I can love your fucking sensitivity, devs. You really nail the fucking sensitivity in this game. The fuck do you want me to do? Oh. Ha! Fuck. Can't believe you've done this. Next round's on me. Promise. Get the cigarettes. Fucking get the cigarettes. The game. Yes. I love the daddy. Surely not getting stuck. Oi. 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 I'll smash your fucking head in, mate.
Oh, no, 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 please, come on, no! Find a way to get the sears out of the dispenser. What? No! No, please! I'm having a really shit day, and you've just made it worse. Blimey. Alright, uh, what do I need for getting the cigarettes out? I'm guessing I need some sort of tool. Uh, oh, yes. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. <laughs> it's not out yet. Come on, you piece of shit. Don't do this to me. <clears throat> Antique rubbish. Give them to me. Give me my cigarettes. Right, you. That's it. I'm going to go and get my key grip, and they are going to kick the shit out of you. Hey, Charlie. Yeah. I'm still in the bar. I think it's dinner time. We should get everyone else. Okay, I'm coming. And I'm coming back for you with a fucking pry bar. Are you alone in there? Who's that behind the bar? What? What? Didn't even reply to the question. What? <laughs> the fuck? Hey, had a thought on an intro segment. You want to shoot now? Yeah, if we get it shot and in the bank, maybe Charlie will stop rewriting everything I come up with. Yeah. <laughs> okay, sure. What? Nothing. Just give me a sec, and then I'll be good to go. I'm supposed to buy nothing is eating away at you? Yes. How many times have you cleaned that lens? I'm just prepping my gear. Really? Yeah. Always focusing on the detail, Mark. What about taking a huge risk and just do something? I watched you fuss for a whole week before you turned down that job offer, all because you had to take one extra train to get there. The job wasn't the right move. The train thing confirmed it. Flimsy. I don't buy it. You don't have to buy it. Come on, let's just shoot this. Let's use natural light so we can do it alone. Didn't the lobby have skylight? I don't remember. I just want to look decent. You look good in any light. I'm not worried. Are you trying to butter me up? Yes. Is it working? Marginally. I'll take it. Ark, why are you letting them all think I broke up with you? I feel like if Jamie knew the truth, she might back off. I mean, they all just assumed. <laughs> I can't decide if that's sweet or selfish, or both. We're hitting the golden hour. We should be able to find a good spot. <laughs> I don't know why you camera shower. dorks call it that. It's 15 minutes at best. Yes and no, if you have the right reflector. 15 minutes at the most. <laughs> Look, let's go find some light and get started. Thanks for doing this. You're only asking me because your arms are too short for a good selfie angle. My arms are not short. <laughs> Where to? Uh, the balcony would make for a cool angle. Let's find a way up there. How's the new place? It'll do for now. Do you like it? It's just a place to keep my shit and crash. Short term lease, so I can take my time. Whoa, there, bucko. I was just checking for light. Remember our talk about boundaries? I need my room to be my private, safe place. Then close the fucking door! Sometimes I'm glad we went to therapy. Other times, it makes for some weird ass rules. Uh, I don't I understand what they wanted me to do the about the camera. The Press left mouse button? The perfect place with the oh, right wait. Wall color near the proper train station or bus stop or... Maybe we should just add this topic to our discussion. What the fuck do they want me to do with this? Yeah. 
You're probably right. So, since we can't do it tomorrow, is next weekend okay to come and get my stuff? There's something back here. Let's take a photo, I guess. Zoom out. That was a good photo. Professional photographer. What is the, the lower in indicator? I don't know what the fuck it's supposed to tell me. It was green on her, so I'm guessing that it was good. So if Dumet catches us in here, are we breaking? Ah! Shit! <laughs> Eight o'clock! <laughs> Time for the call! Get the fuck out of me. I feel like Demet is the kind of dude who loses his shit if you break his rules. Oh, what was your first the devil. when he took away our phones like we were kind of teenagers? I don't know. You tell me. A must for Morello fans. It's like an analysis of your worst nightmares. Can't see shit. What is this? Camera? Oh. Balcony? Well... Hmm, very sus. There's gotta be a way through. There must be some kind of way through. There. Look at this wallpaper. This is old as hell. Everything here is old as hell. I was Actually, old it's quite new. Inside. It's a replica. Manny Sherman, born January 1, 1956. Come on. You know all this. What do you want? What's this? You've been doing your research, haven't you, Special Agent Monday? What are my favorite television programs? Describe my first pet? What were your friends like as a child? What is this? You're taking a survey, you're trying to learn something. Would it kill you to be direct? You wanted to know what inspired me? As if I wasn't an original? Well... Maybe there was one man I found myself a little fascinated by. Henry Howard Holmes. Why? Because he was numero uno. America's first. The guy invented the trade. He set the benchmark, you know? Learn your history, Monday. Read a book. You think because I stuck a blade in some people and get off on it, I'm not smart? I, uh, allegedly killed 13 people before you got smart enough to find me. Oh. Only 13 Rod people in 1950. Right. That's it. Forensics. Huh? Since we got here, I've been smelling something faint, distant. Can't place it. It's decay. Well, 
Old house. There. See that key? Just need to find a way through. Up here. Retarded. Stay tuned. Uh, I guess that will work. Oh, 360. No scope. Push it to the limit. Ah, these controllers, man. Yeah. Keep your head down. Keep your head down. Aren't you afraid of heights? Hi. There was something shining there. I swear the book was... I can't go there. Alright. Aha! Golden legendary! Score. Alright, how many do you get? Seven, twelve, five. Nice. Inflation. Pog. Okay, we're looking for. Right, that makes sense. This is gonna be closed, yeah. There's no way this guy's gonna jump across here if he's afraid of heights. For a fucking golden shower, wherever the fuck he wanted. Is this this oh. should work mark you okay in there i'll be right back i'll be right back dark souls shortcuts that's new We've broken through. for a key. 